Guys, wait to file your taxes because the United States government just issued a $78 billion bill that give you a higher child tax credit, which ultimately give you a higher refund. Now, in today's video, I'm going to explain how to get this money, who qualify, and who don't. Guys, stay tuned. to the channel guys if you're new to the channel a credit coach q now created the first cloud-based software that allows you to put your credit repair expenses in your own hands if you're new to the channel i'm super super excited because i have a banger today's video we're going to talk about a higher refund on your taxes but before we get into the video guys please like and subscribe to the channel it allows youtube to push this content to a wider audience it also allows us to leave the lights on guys please like and subscribe to the channel if you have anything derogatory in your credit report i mean anything negative charge-offs late payments bankruptcies medical bills guys you name it please go over to mycreditapproved.com it's the website and the software that i was telling the, telling you about that it allows you to put the full experience to your own hands guys people are removing thousands of dollars worth of debt by themselves they are no longer using credit repair companies that are putting this information in this experience into their own hands and appreciating on a deeper level guys please go to mycreditapproved.com check out the software and start removing these items guys if you have anything derogatory on your credit report now let Let's dive straight into the meat and potatoes of this video. Guys, I'm super excited about this video because everyone loved tax season. Tax season is, it used to be the best season when I was a kid because my mom used to basically give us a late Christmas because that was the only time that she was able to have a, a, a little extra of money to actually give us, you know, any type of luxury. So now, this bill that the United States government just issued is giving away almost four to five hundred dollars extra per child. In today's video, like I said, I'm going to explain who qualifies i have everything written down on who qualifies, who doesn't and how to actually obtain it now what is saying in the tax relief for american families and workers act is the name of the bill on january 19 2024 the house ways and means committee overwhelmingly approved the tax relief for american families and workers act of 2024 by a vote of 40 uh, to 3 vote the bill provides for increases in child tax credit delays and requirements to deduct research and experimentation expenditures over a five-year period extends a hundred percent bonus depreciation through 2025 and increases the code section 179 deduction limitation now guys what i love about this bill is that basically it is uh fixing the wrong that happened a couple years ago so basically this is a refundable credit due to the inflation over a course of uh, a few years right so it says that the child tax credit the long change for individuals in proposed bill is an expansion of child tax credit under current law under current law the child tax credit is equal to two thousand per child for taxpayers who do not have earned income in the excess of certain thresholds amounts and i'm going to explain those thresholds in a minute a portion of this two thousand dollars can be applied as a refundable credit up to an inflation adjusted amount of sixteen hundred from 2023 for a taxpayers with one or two children the refundable portion is limited to the lesser of now, this is the measurement of who qualifies, who doesn't, right? So if you are married with one kid and you made $45,000 combined, you do not want to file um, because what's going to happen if you file early, let me explain this first. If you file before this time period or before this bill was passed or is going to get passed, what you, you're you going to have to amend it and pay, pay extra money for someone to amend it for you to actually get this extra dollars. So the IRS rest do not open up until the 29th of january anyway and everyone that filed early was thirsty and a lot of people are so they filed early but you have to still wait until the irs open in order for your file to actually go through processing right now everyone files in pending status and if you already filed uh via turbo tax or any other personnel you're going to have to amend it because you cannot change it because it's already independent status sent to the irs so let me go back to this so this is who qualifies if you married with one kid, like I said, $45,000 combined between the two people with one kid, you do not want to file because you actually qualify. If you are married with two kids, you make a combined $63,000 household income, you do not want to file. If you are married with three kids and you make a combined $79,000, you do not want to file. If you are married with one kid, no, if you are not married with one kid or qualifying dependents, you do not want to file. With one kid and 
$38,000. So if you have one kid and you make $38,000 or less, you do not want to file because you qualify for this extra income. If you are not married with two kids and you make $55,000, you do not want to file because you qualify for this extra income. If you are married with three kids and you make $71,000, you do not want to file because you qualify for this income. So guys, this, depending on how many kids you have and how much income that you range um, for your household can give you even hundreds, not if not hundreds, thousands of dollars extra on your refund. So guys, it's always um, good to basically let, I don't want to say not file early, but you always want to file in the middle. You always want to let the people that file early get knocked out and you always want to file in the middle because it allowed everything to go smoothly. You know, that's what I've heard. So I don't know. I'm not a tax professional, but I do have friends that are and they say the process of people who file in the middle, they get processed the easiest. If you file, the early eyes are on it, fresh eyes. And if you file late, fresh eyes, because there's not that many people that's actually going through processing. But if you file in the middle, you get to wait for situations like this, you know? So a situation where a bill is getting passed that's going to give your household an extra thousand or couple thousand dollars is always good. So guys, this is the qualifying factors for you to get approved for this. Let me know in the comment section, have you filed or did not file? Leave it in the comment section. Till next time, guys, take care of your credit and take care of yourself. Credit Coach Q out. Peace.